Alright everybody, so we're going to start off here. I got my fishing shirt of the month shirt here. I think they're getting cooler every month in my opinion. But for the reason you guys are really here is I got the Lucky Tackle Box tournament box. Finally manned up to get it. Uh, just to kind of show a comparison here. Here's a Mystery Tackle Box Pro Box. Look at the size difference. Look at that. That is insane. So let's see what we got in here. What do you even do with this box? Oh, also when I got it, I used the promo code to get a free extra lure. So I guess we'll go with this one first here. It's a Livingston's Flatmaster. Oh, wow. Lure app tackle. Or the, the tracks all catch data. Oh, wow. So this thing will actually track your catches. You can download an app in the App Store. Oh, that's cool. But we'll get into that later. All right. So, you get your pretty, pretty wrapping in there. Very pretty. Let's break that open. Oh, don't do that. There we go. Oh my goodness. Look at all that tackle. It's ridiculous. Ridiculous. All right, here's our card. So there's our card of our uh, tackle there. Oh, yeah. All right, so I guess we will start at the top with Bagley Bait Co. Shallow Balsa Minnow. Give me a second to find it. Holy moly. Oh, there we go. There's Bagley Box. Alright, it says it's an LTB exclusive. This box is so big it's hard to handle. Alright, let's see here, does it have a color? Anything, anything? Nope, okay. So, right there. This should be silent. Yeah, silent. Balsa body. It says anything on the card here. Made from balsa wood. Slim body. Short lip allows the bait to run down just below the surface. So this is basically top water. Uh, that's about all I can really say here. Alright, so that's our first bait. Alright, now from Liquid Mayhem, we have the garlic crawfish. I think I saw that when I was digging in here. Oh yeah. Alright, so we got fish attractant. An entire tube of fish attractant. I don't know if I want to open it in here. I think I'll pass on opening that in here. But I'm sure it's a very garlicky scent there. Very cool. Alright, now from Backstabber Lures, we have the Squarebill Crankbait. So this is tournament series. It is in foil pearl color. Does it have a size? Does it not have a size? Alright, that's pretty pretty darn shiny right there, isn't it? So what makes this so strange is as you guys can tell your treble instead of being on the bottom is on the top. So, I'm feeling, you know, this is when you're you're down there, you know, like this, and the fish kind of comes and swipes at it this way, and you get that bite, but no hook set. Now you're going to get that hook set, because that hook is on the top. And it has very deep rattles, super sticky hooks. That's pretty cool. Alright, so that was our second actual bait. Alright, now from Knockout Bait Co., we have the Sucker Punch. Saw that in here somewhere. There we go, this thing is heavy. Hit him with the hook. 
So this is two and a half inches, one and a half ounce, pretty heavy. Made in China. Kind of like a little little bluegill. And that might be a whole lead body, holy crap. So look at this thing. Look at the paint on that thing. I don't know how good you guys can see that. That is ridiculous. So you got treble on the bottom. You got a little willow willow? No. Colorado leaf blade. It's been a while. On the back, I'm sure you could probably switch that out for another treble, I guess, if you wanted. But look at that paint on there. That is just insane. Silent, too. There's nothing in there. That is really neat. Alright. Smart baits. We have the Smart Bomb. These smart baits, right? Yes. Smart Bomb. Alright. Okay, so this is one of those ones where it's supposed to change colors depending on water temperature and all of that good stuff. So this is the June Bug Blood Red, I believe. Right here. So basically stick bait. Mm, not sure that's scented. It's kind of has a plasticky smell, so probably use some of that garlic scent on there, I guess. Very neat. I tried to get one of these to change color in a water bottle one time in my previous video. It didn't work. Did not work. Alright, so there's our first, blah, 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 first soft plastic. <clears throat> now from Strike King, we have the Rage Lizard. Oh boy. Alright. And it is in Watermelon Red Flake. Very good color. I love when they come in like little cassette things, hold them, hold them straight, so they all curled up. So you can pull one out here. All right. So as it sounds, little lizard. I'm sure most of you guys know what one of these is. This has a coffee scent. Yep, coffee scent. Because you know there's fish. They like coffee too. Who don't like coffee? Did I do it backwards? No, I did it right. Okay, get that back in there. Alright. Put that off to the side. I'll put that away later. Oh darn, my thing closed. Okay. Now from Stellar Jig Co. We have the Rover. This is going to be like a 30 minute video. This is ridiculous. Alright, so now we got Jig. Black and blue Jig. Try to speed this up a little bit. So, football jig, black and blue football jig. It's got the Wii Keeper, very nice. Don't really know too much to say about that. All right, now from Wu Tungsten, we have the finesse kit. Let's see if I can find that. Okay, here we go. Yeah, I've gotten one of these before. So basically you got, you know, your drop shot weight, little, you know, just tungsten weights, you got um, little nail weights right there, some beads, uh, bobber stoppers, so it's pretty much just a whole finesse little setup. You can, you know, do wacky rig, Nico rigs, let's see if it says anything here. Alright, so we got two eighth ounce tungsten flipping weights, we got one eighth ounce teardrop weight, one eighth ounce skinny drop shot weight 130 seconds nail weights and then we have some flipping beads and some bobber stops and that says it's a LTB exclusive as well so that's pretty cool alright where's my card again I lost my card alright okay cool we're over here now alright so from Cabin Creek we have the Express Bug Alrighty, so this is kind of like a like a beaver kind of kind of looking thing here, beaver tail kind of looking thing. Looks like it's in a, a smoke black flake. Huh? It says green pumpkin. 
Oh, I guess it is green pumpkin. Never mind. Green pumpkin, very garlicky scent. I can smell it already. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. So that's pretty neat. Probably throw that on the jig. Ugh. Slimy. All right. From V and M, we have the drop shad. VM, alright. Another soft plastic here. So here it's kinda like a what is it, Super Fluke Jr. I think. Where it just has a little little tail. There that's a green pumpkin. Green pumpkin. Just green pumpkin. Mm, nope, not scented either. It's five pack. So this would be good for like a drop shot or Something, something in that fitness kit right there go great with that all right now from Texas tackle we have the big bug so everything's bigger in Texas so it's probably gonna be huge eh, you know, there's a little kind of like beaver tail looking thing so this is in would not have a color again, not for human consumption, made in the USA though. Very nice. Has a little bit of a kind of a I guess a squid scent to it. If I had to had to pick one, I would pick squid. Okay. Now from Dainty, we have two black nickel and three bleeding bait flat gap or fat gap hooks. Yeah, I guess those have a little bit of a red tint to them. Three aught worm hooks, flat, fat gap worm hooks. I'm not gonna take those out because no point to it's just you know a hook. We've all seen hooks. All right, and then from katana, katana hook, katana hooks. We got the extra wide gap three aught pack. All right, so three out, extra wide gap. Looks right there. Hopefully you guys can see those in the baggage. And I think that oh nope we forgot we forgot something. Oh boy. All right, so we got the Biowa. They are the let's see here. I don't even know. There's so many things on there. I have to pull them out. I'll have it written, you know, down here in the bottom. Holy moly, what is that? So it's like a really short, fat stick bait. I guess. Not for human consumption. Keep out of reach of children. Because, of course, a child wants to chew on that. It is scented. B2A scented. So it's two and a quarter inches, eight pack. That is uh, interesting. Very interesting. Never seen anything like quite like that. All right, what's left in the package? Nothing good there. And they seem to be trying to get me to get progressive insurance. No sticker? They did not give me a sticker. Oh man, how I'm mad. So yeah, so that's the tournament box. As you guys could tell, it is a crap load. Just a crap load of tackle. So if you guys enjoyed this video, please like, subscribe, and have a great day.